All right, folks, today we have a 2007 Ford Focus um, four-door sedan. Uh, I believe it's the SES model, okay? All right, first things first, let's start it up. All right, and as you can see, starts right up there. Um, it does have the uh, door jar light on because I have the back uh, trunk open. All right, but as you see, no other warning lights. Okay, and there's our mileage, 131,386 miles. All right, so first thing we'll do is check out our windows. I do have the AC running right now. It's nice and cold um, because it is kind of humid out. So sitting in a car on a hot day without AC is no fun, so I did turn the air on. All right, so as you see, our windows up, down, all right, and then our driver's side, all the way down, all the way up. All right, we do have cruise control here on the wheel. Okay, um, a CD player. All right, I don't have a CD, so I'm not sure if the CD player works, but I know obviously radio works, no problem there. Okay, like I said, I do have the AC on right now, coming out nice and cold. No problem there. We have an automatic, okay, and our handbrake here in the middle. I just like to show that because sometimes um, you need that for a driving test or something. If you need a car with a handbrake in the middle there for, you know, a first car for someone. All right. So there you see some pretty decent uh, power equipment there. All right. So let's hop out and have a look at the motor. We have a four-cylinder motor here. Uh, 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 I think it is 2.0 liter four-cylinder. All right, so what I'm going to do here, just be quiet once you guys listen to the motor. And I'll give you a quick look around in here. And that's the motor, like I said, 2.0 liter four cylinder motor. Okay, let's close this up. All right, the next thing we're gonna check out here is our tread depth on our tires. And unfortunately, it doesn't look like we got much tread on the front tire here. I wouldn't say much of anything really. Maybe 1 32nd there. So you're gonna need front tires. All right, and the same on this side as well. You can see the nice uh, alloy Ford wheels, though. All right, looks like we got a good tire on this side. We got about 6.30 seconds on this side. And again, not much tread depth on this side. So we got maybe one decent tire, the rest not so much. All right, so there are tires. So let's have a look at the interior of the vehicle. Okay, as you can see, cloth interior. Got some staining on the seat. Here's a look at our floor. And our dashboard, as you can see, pretty good shape, not all busted up. Here's our middle console. Okay, <clears throat> let's have a look at our door jams. See pretty good shape all the way around, and especially down low here. All right, and our door panel. See that's in good shape, not all busted up. And then the door itself. All right, so you can see that's pretty clear down below, uh, down low on the door there. Looks like I locked myself out. All right. All right, now to the back, where you see some more staining here in the back there, as well as, it's like a cigarette burn. All right, and there's our floor. Okay, let's get a shot of our door jam. All 
right, and the door panel itself, you can see it's in good shape there. And then our door. And then down low, of course. All right, you can see pretty good shape there. All right, so let's head to the trunk. All right, there's the back of uh, the top of the trunk, or the bottom, I say, underneath. Good shape there, don't have any corrosion up here. All right, and the trunk itself. As you can see, like I said, this is the four-door sedan. It's not the wagon, which a lot of the focuses are. So you got a decent amount of trunk space, um, and also, like I said, four doors as well. All right, so we'll close that up, and we'll take a look again at the seat. All right, and the floor. Okay, and our door jam. Let's see, good shape all the way around there. No corrosion or anything, our door panel. And then the door itself. All right. Guys, uh, let's have a look here at our driver's seat. Okay, so your driver's seat there. And the floor, you can see obviously two holes on the carpet there and there. Pedals. Okay, and the edge of the seat. Let's have a look at our door jam. And our door panel, see that's all intact there. All right, folks, so there it is. There's the interior of the vehicle. Let me get a shot from the inside. There's our headliner. Okay. All right, so that's the interior of the vehicle. Take a step back and let's show the outside, okay? So we got a nice clean black shiny out exterior here. Okay, we'll start with this front panel here. Let's have a nice clean look at it. Pretty good shape there. Right, follow this up to the roof. See our antenna in the middle. And one or two scratches, but nothing really major, nothing deep. And here's our driver's door. You see you've got a little scratch there and a little bit on the molding. But again, not too deep, nothing major. Alright, let me get you a shot that well here. Alright, here's our passenger or rear door on the driver's side. See pretty good shape there on this door panel. One little scratch there, nothing major. All right, and on our back quarter panel here, nice and clean. Okay, you can see the wheel well as, as well. All right, here's our roof, our roof, our trunk. Of course, with a little spoiler on the back. Okay, I'll back up and have a shot of the trunk. There's the Focus SES. You can see pretty good shape there. All right, what I'll do is get you shot down low all the way around the bumper. Just a couple, you know, minor little bumps in the plastic. Nothing major. Nothing cracked or broken or anything. All right, and we'll head over to this panel here. A little, two little dents. See how shiny the paint is? It's like a mirror almost. And another shot of the roof. Okay. Alright, do have, as you can see, a dent there. That's about it. A little nick on the bottom there. Just a shot down low of our little.
Again, pretty good shape on this door. All right. And into our front quarter panel here. See another little ding right there. And, all right. Let's have a look at our hood. First things first, you know, just a scratch right there. A couple other little ones you can see. So there's your hood, and let me get you a shot of the front, <coughs> and then of course down low here. Alright folks, so there you go, 2007 Ford Focus SES four-door sedan. Alright, you can see black paint's in pretty good shape, interior is okay as well. Um, so next thing I'm going to do is take it out on a quick test drive. All right, folks, we're going to take this 2007 Ford Focus SES sedan out for a quick test drive. Um, had it running for a little bit. It's warmed up, started up, no problem, warm. Okay, so next thing we're going to do is just take it out on the road here. As you can see, nice and smooth, all the way up to 50 miles an hour, no problem. Uh, transmission felt good, motor's running good, no problem there. straight down the road. Let's here, turn around and do the same thing all the way back. Alright, as you guys can probably tell, we just had a little summer's rainstorm go through in about 10 minutes between the two videos. Right, looks like we're good here. all the way up to 50 miles an hour. Nice and smooth. All right, so hands off the wheel. Yeah, maybe a little bit to the left. That's probably due to the tires being, the tread being a little low. All right, so the last thing we're gonna do here is we're gonna do a brake check into the parking lot across from us. So what I'm gonna do is just pull off, just stand on the brakes. Um, just give it a nice firm brake check. All right, so we'll slow down a little bit. All right over here. All right, hands off the wheel. All right, and as you see, we stopped in a nice straight line. Wheel didn't go one way or the other uh, real bad. The car wasn't pulling one way or the other, so it shows you that you know the brakes feel good. And as I was driving, I noticed there wasn't any pulsation or anything either, so that's good um, as well. Folks, so that's it. 2007 Ford Focus SES, a four-door sedan. It's not a wagon, okay? Um, and you know, you saw the interior and the exterior and everything. So what I'm going to do is give you one last look around of the vehicle. All right, and let me just get the exact mileage up again. I think it's 131 something else. Uh, 131,387 thousand miles all right so again one last quick look at the vehicle um, you can see nice pretty good you know looking body all the way around I showed you one or two little dings and dents nothing major 
Okay, Let's see there's the front. All right, so maybe if you're looking for a, a smaller car for commuting, or maybe a first time driver's looking for the car, you'd see it's pretty small. Um, it's got the four cylinder motor, so it'd be pretty decent gas mileage out of it. All right, so maybe that's something, if you're looking for something like that, this would be the car for you guys. All right, and it does still have a couple months left on its uh, Jersey State inspection there, so you can see it goes until October. All right, well, thanks for watching, folks, and we hope to, hope to hear from you soon.